Hello everyone. Good morning. Welcome back to English class. Are you all ready? Yes. Very good. Children, follow the instructions carefully. To copy in class work, I have updated the notes in My Class Campus app. But some of you are not aware of that. So again, I am giving in today's online class. Okay, so that you can follow it and copy in the class work you need to children you need to be reading the monkeys go fasting okay all of you write heading the monkeys go fasting okay first bit hard words children first bit hard words i will read it children hard words listen carefully first one angsters Second, distributing. Third, chief. Fourth, promise. Fifth, uncomfortably. Sixth, imagine. Seven, disappeared. Eight, throats. Nine, hungry. Ten, Fasting. Okay, children. Next, second bit. Comprehension. Comprehension. Answer the following questions. Okay. In that first question, who spoke the following words and to whom? Who spoke the following words and to whom? Okay, children. First, listen. Listen, all of you. All these birds, all these bits already we have discussed, children. I have explained in last class. Okay. Once again, just I will read it to copy in your classwork. Okay. Listen carefully. First of all, who spoke the following words and to whom? First sentence keep the food ready. Keep the food ready. Who spoke this word? Monkey chief. Monkey chief spoke to monkeys. Okay. Yes. Next number two. Yes. Let's do that. This verse. Fat monkey spoke to young monkey. Okay. Next third one. Can I keep the banana in my mouth? These words. A little monkey spoke to father monkey. Okay, children. Yes. And the next, the second one is, second question, children. Do you think the monkeys can go on fast? Why? Why not? The answer, the monkeys cannot go on fast because they do not have regular eating habits. They eat whenever they feel hungry and they cannot stay hungrily for lots of time. Next, third one, children. Third, look at your device, all of you, and look into your textbook also. If you have page number 30, third one, as we can see from the story, monkeys peeled the bananas before eating them. Now, such is the way we eat. Each of the following fruits and vegetables and add them. Few words are given in the box, children. Orange, papaya, carrot, grapes, goa, coconut. And again, some of the clues are given in the bracket. Cut, peel, break as a whole. Okay. Yes, here answer wise table is given children. Same as it is you copy in your classwork. Okay, yes. First one, name of the fruit children, orange. The way we eat, we peel and eat. Okay, yes. Second one, papaya, cut. Third, carrot. Cut. Fourth, grapes. 
as a whole. Five, Goa, cut. Six, coconut, break. Okay? Yes. The next one is, children, look here, conventions of writing. The next one is, conventions of writing. Make necessary corrections using capital letter, comma, and full stop. Rewrite the sentence. Kulte pancake, said the man. Here, in the blank, answer is given, children. Just you copy the same. Okay? Good day, pancake, said the man. End of the sentence, full stop, children. Beginning letter should be capital letter. After good day, put comma there. Okay? Yes. Next. Children, look here. Copy. Copy all these bits, one to four bits. In your class, work neatly and learn. Okay, now let's start today's class. First, let's begin with hard words from unit three. What is a tree? Okay, children. Yes, let's begin. First, I will read, children. Then you can repeat. Each word, repeat after me. Okay, first one drawings. D R A W I N G S drawings. Number two, notebook. N O T E B O O K notebook. Next, number three, squirrel. S Q U I R R E L squirrel. Next, number four. Field. F I E L D. Field. Next, number five. Farmer. F A R M E R. Farmer. Next, sixth one. Fisherman. F I S H E R M A N. Fisherman. Number seven. Homemaker, H-O-M-E-M-A-K-E-R, homemaker. Number eight, bundle, B-U-N-D-L-E, bundle. Next nine, shade, S-H-A-D-E, shade. Number ten, umbrella. U M B R E L L E umbrella. Eleventh one, meals. M E A L S meals. Number twelve, sticks. S T I C K S sticks. Are you all repeating, children? Yes. Very good. Thirteenth one, firewood, F-I-R-E-W-O-O-D, firewood. Okay, the next number 14, remember, R-E-M-E-M-B-E-R, -E -E remember. Number 15, idea, I-D-E-A, idea. 16. Plow. P L O U G H. Plow. Okay, children. Yes. Look here, children. Here. Now let's continue with the meanings. Next bit is meanings. Okay. Yes. Look here. First one is homemaker. First one. Homemaker. Homemaker means a wife who does work at home. A wife who does work at home. Okay. Yes. Next, number two. Second one is firewood. Second one, firewood. 
firewood means wood uses to make fire wood used to make fire firewood means wood used to make fire okay yes number 3 plow plow means a large farming implement with one or more blades fixed in a frame drawn over soil to turn it to turn it over and cut furrows in preparation for the planting of seeds okay yes next shall we read once again children plow plow means a large farming implement with one or more blades fixed in a frame drawn over soil to turn it over and cut furrows in preparation for the planting of seeds okay yes next fourth one children meal do you know the meaning of meal ah uh, yes yes children let's see now meal means any of the regular occasions in a day when a reasonably large amount of food is taken meal morning breakfast lunch dinner all these are meals children okay yes and the next one is children next topic is vocabulary okay text book page number 36 text book page number 36 vocabulary children yes here trees are very important for us they help us in many ways how do they help us how do they help us okay yes now look here children yes uses of a tree uses of a tree yes i will read children complete the word web given below first oxygen children for trees give us food oxygen medicines furniture firewood shade rain control pollution once again children all of you repeat uses of a tree yes trees give us food repeat all of you food oxygen medicines for nature firewood shade rain control pollution okay yes And the next one is look here children here yes the next bit is open textbook textbook page number 36 textbook page number 36 okay yes second bit children all the parts of trees are useful to us in different ways okay all the parts of trees are useful to us in different ways draw the part and write their uses already one is done for you children yes here leaf fruit root flower okay we have to write about them now name of your leaf neem or already they have given children in your textbook just look into your textbook all of you those are not having textbooks look into your device name name of your leaf is neem uses medicine 
Ugadi Pachari manual. Okay, yes. Once, ladies and children, about neem leaves, I will show health benefits of neem. Okay, yes, ladies and children, all of you. Neem contains antibacterial properties. Neem contains antibacterial properties. And children, it cures asthma. Okay, cures asthma. Control diabetes. Okay, helps to cure leprosy. It helps to cure leprosy also. And it may work as a contraceptive in some cases. Okay, and it helps to treat ulcers also. And it maintains oral hygiene and health. It increases blood circulation children. Okay, yes. And next one is, look here children. And next one is, listen. Fruit. Let's discuss about apple. Okay. Name of your fruit is apple. And its uses. It is nutritious. And we can make jam, jelly. And it is good for heart. Antioxidants, children. Okay. Yes. Again, let's see about apple. Okay. Incredible health benefits of apples. Okay, yes, it stimulates weight loss. Weight loss, children. Okay, balance blood sugar levels. It balances blood sugar levels and strengthen immunity. Apples strengthen immunity. Okay, and it improves your eyesight. Apples improve your eyesight and children it is great for your teeth and gums yes okay it keeps healthy your teeth and gums and it builds stronger bones it builds stronger bones also children and give you energy apples give you energy and relieve muscle tension it relieves muscle tension. Children, it improves fertility in women. It improves fertility in women. Okay. And it improves cardiovascular health. And it improves brain function. Okay. Yes. Incredibly alkalizing. Okay. And then let's go back. The textbook, children. Next topic is root. Root. Let's take carrot, children. Okay. Name carrot. And uses we can make sweets with carrots. Okay. Children likes it very much. Carrot halwa, children. Do you like it? Yes. Next, it prevent cancer. And carrots are good for skin. We can make curry, juice, etc. Okay? Yes. Let's see now. Few more benefits of carrots. Health benefits of carrots, children. Health benefits of carrots. It improves vision. Okay? It improves vision. It helps prevent cancer. It helps prevent cancer it promotes healthier skin children it promotes healthier skin and it helps prevent infection it helps prevent infection and it promotes healthier skin children from the outside it helps promotes healthier skin and it prevents heart diseases it prevents Heart disease and cleans the body. It cleanses the body and protects teeth and gums. Carrots protects teeth and gums. And it prevents stroke also, children. 
it prevents stroke yes now and the next topic is children look here flower about flower okay now let's take rose flower children do you like rose all of you yes i like rose it's very beautiful rose is a beautiful flower i like it do you like children yes everybody likes now let us see the uses of roses okay yes it children it helps us in oil control moisturizer okay rose tea also we can make rose tea also it's a wound healing children okay yes it gives us vitamins a b c d e and k okay we get sense we can make sense soaps also children okay let us see few more benefits yes look here children rose buds soothing the stomach and liver okay it's a immune booster it improves blood circulation reduce body fats okay reduce body fats eases constipation eases indigestion moisturizes skin it moisturizes skin next defends against free radicals okay it supports bone healing roses supports bone healing and it provides vitamins a b c e k okay and it relieves knee pain also children it relieves knee pain okay yes and the next is children look here all of you next bit is yes let us see the next bit textbook page number 37 all of you open textbook page number 37 those who are not having textbooks you can follow the device okay yes textbook page number 37 third bit write the names of plants or trees from which you get the following okay from which you get the following children look here fruits vegetables plants leafy vegetables okay now 1 to 9 numbers are given we have to fill this table children okay yes let's start with fruits fruits children mango banana custard apple 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 goa papaya grapes jackfruit watermelon okay yes now let's see few more fruits children okay yes let's read children look into your device all of you apple watermelon oranges pears cherries strawberries nectarines carambola we find this in uk children and same fruit in usa they call it star fruit okay yes and the next one grapes plums mangoes pomegranates apricot raspberries mandarins bananas blueberries papayas grapefruit lemon limes pineapples jackfruit melon coconuts avocados yes peaches kiwi 
Okay? Yes. Now, next one is vegetables. Okay? Next, vegetables, children. All of you look into your textbook, page number 37. Let's read brinjal, tomato, cucumber, lady's finger, bottle gun, pumpkin, beans, cabbage, drumstick. Okay? Yes. Now let's see few more. Few more vegetables. Yes. I'll read it, children. Look into your device, all of you. Potato, tomato, eggplant, green pepper, corn, carrot, mushroom, radish, garlic, pea, red cabbage, red pepper, broccoli, cauliflower, celery, onion. Okay? Yes. Now, let's come back to our textbook. Page number 37. Children, again, third one, flowers. Okay? Yes, about flowers. First, I'll read out, children. See the list of flowers. Hibiscus, rose, jasmine, lily, marigold, night queen, lotus, sunflower, tulips. Okay? Now let's see a few more flowers. Yes. Children, let's read now. If Different kinds of flowers are here. Rose, rose, lotus, daffodils, arches, children, nerium, oleander, next poppy, daisy, dahlia. Kanna, purple malo. Next one, Glodiolus, arm lily. Next, next one, children, look here. Yes, buttercup. Here, next down one, below that, buttercup. Common bluebell. Next one, sunflower. Tulips. Tiger lily. Calendula. And next one, next water lily. Lily. Next, dianthus. Lavender. Aster. Lilac, coxcomb, here jasmine, next one, periwinkle, peony, bird of paradise, next petunia, next Hibiscus, Bougainvillea, next last one is Bougainvillea, okay, yes, children, now again, let's come back to our textbook, leafy vegetables, about leafy vegetables, now let's read children, leafy vegetables, Mint. Mint means pudina children. Mint. Fenugreek. Coriander. Spinach. Spinach means palak children. Broccoli. Spring onion. Cabbage. Cauliflower. Amaranthus. Yes. Let's see few more leafy vegetables. Yes. 
look at this picture children spinach spinach we call it palak okay yes here next one green spinach red spinach spleen maranthus next methi leaves that means fenugreek children next pachakaria pachakiria next one is pachakiria coriander common purslain common purslain next cabbage next one is hummingbird tree leaves hummingbird tree leaves okay next picture this also children coriander leaves okay yes yes this one once again we'll see children once again spinach palak green spinach red spinach spleen amaranthus methi leaves that means fenugreek pocha kirai next coriander common purslain cabbage hummingbird tree leaves coriander leaves okay yes and the next one is children look here all of you once again uh, come back here so textbook page number 35 page number 35 children once again all of you look into your textbook page number 35 okay that is comprehension page number 35 comprehension children this one is not there in your device all of you look into your textbook page number 35 okay yes answer the following questions answer the following questions children first one what was amu writing in her notebook why first question is what was Ammu writing in her notebook? Why? Okay. Yes. First answer is Ammu's teacher told to write about what is a tree. Okay. Yes. Number two. What idea did Ammu get while talking with Big Two? What idea did Ammu get while talking with Big Two? Okay. Yes, children, look here. Amu got an idea to ask others, what is a tree? She got an idea to ask others, what is a tree? And third one, children, third one. When Amu asked what a tree is, different people gave different answers. What are they? Okay. Yes. Now, first one, farmer farmer children look here tree is a plow to make his field ready farmer said tree is a plow to make his field ready and next to fisherman fisherman children fisherman said tree is a boat to carry human across waters okay yes next homemaker homemaker said Tree is a firewood to cook meals for her family. Okay. Tree is a firewood to cook meals for her family. Next to traveler children. Traveler said, tree is a shade and it's like umbrella for me. He said, traveler said that tree is a shade and it's like umbrella for him. Okay. Next to children. Children said, tree is a place for them to play. Okay, next to parrot said, parrot said, tree is a place to live and food to eat. Okay, yes, children, look here, all of you. Here, already we have come to the end of our today's lesson. Okay, today's class.
Once again, I remind you to copy in the classwork. Children, heading, the monkey school fasting. Then first bit, next to second bit, next to third bit, again fourth bit. Okay, write in order, neatly and clearly. And also not simply copying in your classwork, children. You have to learn perfectly. Okay, yes. Okay, children, again we'll meet in next class. Thank you. Have a nice day.